Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Chief and Visions. I am Glay, your ICT teacher, and for today's tutorial, I will be teaching you how to create a landscape or terrain layout in SketchUp. So let's get started. So we are now in our SketchUp workplace. The first step is put your cursor here upward and then right click your mouse and then find the sandbox tool here. So by the way, this is in alphabetical order so you can immediately locate the sandbox. It's in this part here. So click sandbox and you can see here the sandbox tool. You can, you can see several options here but we will focus on the first one and the second one. So first thing is to click the first, the second one. This one is the from scratch. So click that one and then select a starting point. Say for example, I want the point to start here. So click this one and then locate or click for the second point. For example, this one. So I will click that and then you can uh, go to the right or you can have it to the left. In my case, I want it to the right. So then I will be clicking the click anywhere. So let's say for example, this part here. As you can see, you can see here a rectangle. So first, a uh, next step here is to select this one and then right click and then explode. Okay. So next one, you already exploded your your object. So next is click the third one here, which is the smooth. So this will be the ones that will pull uh, the object so that it will be formed into a mountain like or a terrain. Okay, so click this move and then as you can see, you can see a circle here. Okay, so you can now click this one and then you can now push upward so that you can see a, a mountains here in our object. Okay, now say for example, you want your di diameter of your circle to be larger and then focus on the radius here in the, in the lower right. So, sorry, it's not the diameter, it's radius. So for example, the radius set here is 20 meters, so you want your circle to be larger, so just type any number that's greater than 20, say for example 30, and then enter. And as you can see, the radius now is set into 30 meters, and then uh, you can now see that the circle is now larger, so you can now select this one here. Okay, then if you want again to to want to your circle to be smaller, you can just simply uh, type a number that is lower than 30. So for example, let us uh, make it 15. So click number, uh, press number 15 in your keyboard and then enter. As you can see, uh, the circle is now smaller. Okay, so next is let's say for example, you want to apply a grass, uh, a grass uh, material here. So all we need to do is go to the paint bucket here or press letter B in your keyboard. And then select here the you can see here the green, grass like green so since this is not in a, a one object you can select this select everything and then click here the material that you want that you want to apply click that one and then click the object okay so you can just release and then you can see there is already a illusion or there is already a, a terrain or a mountain effect here in our sketch app so next is let us now smoothen the curves so all we need to do is to select everything right click and then click here the soften or smooth edges okay then select and then you can see that it is already uh, smoothened and you can now place every, anything here you can place a house trees or anything that you apply to your design okay so that's how you create a, a mountain or terrain a design here in SketchUp so for more tutorial in SketchUp in order for you to create your own design please subscribe to my channel Jeevan Visions and I see you on my next video goodbye God bless and to God be the glory